Yo, what's up, guys? My name is Cesar, and welcome back to another video. And it's another day in Melbourne. Uh, so yesterday, I checked my radiator fluid on my 46, and it was really low. So I decided to refill the radiator fluid and. Uh, and the fluid was really bad so I decided to drain all the all radiator fluid and put new radiator fluid uh, so I decided to put distilled water and a radiator flusher fluid to clean up the oil rust in the radiator so there won't be any problems so when I'm doing it, I tightened the bleeder screw a little bit too hard and the bleeder screw snapped into two pieces and one part of the uh, bleeder screw is stuck in the upper radiator uh, hose so I tried it to get it out yesterday but it didn't work and so my car is parked at my friend's house it's in Glen Beverly and I'm gonna go today and try as much as possible to get that little piece out from the upper radiator hose so I just I just need to buy the bleeder screw and fix the damn thing and otherwise I need to get a new radiator upper radiator hose with the bleeder screw uh, we'll see what's gonna happen so currently now I'm walking to my friend's house it's like 3.9 kilometers from here mm. what to do man it's a holiday and there are no buses here and also I lost my Mikey card so I can't go in a bus without a Mikey card uh, and uh, Uber costs like eleven dollars. What to do, man? It's good for the body, Axel. If you walk, it's a good exercise as well. So I'm gonna walk. So I'll see you guys when I go there. Guys, we just came to the place. Long walk, guys. Yo, bro. <laughs> what's up? What's up? <laughs> so, guys, as you guys can see here, I successfully managed to remove the upper upper radiator hose. And as you guys can see over here, there's a part of the part of the uh, bleeding screw stuck and I'm gonna try my best to remove this and then I don't have to replace this just need to get a bleeding screw otherwise I need to find this part and replace it so guys also I bleed it out uh, rest of the over oh, uh, rest of the coolant in the radiator and it's all good 
ਤੰਦੀ ਨੇ ਬਾਰੇ ਕਸੇ ਕਰੀ ਗਈ ਲਵਾ ਗਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਕਹਿ ਰਹੇ ਸੋ ਗਾਇਸ ਆਈ ਟ੍ਰਾਈਡ ਟੂ ਸੋ ਗਾਇਸ ਆਈ ਟ੍ਰਾਈਡ ਟੂ ਰਿਮੂਵ ਥਿਸ ਪਾਰਟ ਵਿਦ ਅ ਵਿਦ ਅ ਸਕਰੂ ਡਰਾਈਵਰ ਆਈ ਬ੍ਰੋਕ ਦ ਸਕਰੂ ਡਰਾਈਵਰ ਗਾਇਸ ਆਲ ਵੀ ਹੈਵ ਟੂ ਡੂ ਇਸ try to find a replacement for this yo what's up guys it's the next day so today we are going to the wreckers to find a, a upper radiator hose and we are on the way right now we are like the gas and we're going to wreckers so hey bro so guys yo, this is minidu what's up what's up we are going to find a radiator hose for this one yeah What's up guys? We just came to the wreckers and the goal is to find the find the upper upper radiator hose and if you are lucky enough uh, we also need a uh, we also need the right side grill for my E46 because it's broken uh, the pins are broken if you are lucky enough we'll find a grill as well Para red button you good radiator in heba it galo la ha ha me gana si sal what's happening now so guys we are trying to find it part that we are looking for currently ye wahan pe dikha se na pe ke na dikhna wala ah hmm na ba git kar lo kad na ਕੋਈ ਰੇਡੀਟਰ ਹੋਸ ਗੱਲ ਹੋ ਲਵਾ ਮੋਡੀਫਾਈ ਕਰ ਲਗਾਣ ਵਾਰੀ ਇਹ ਬੀਐਮ ਸਵਿਚ ਹੈ ਇਹ ਕੋਈ ਬੀਐਮ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੈ this is what's the update so far we didn't find the part we needed so we are looking we, but we just found the the broken off yeah uh, bleeder screw okay uh, now we just need the bleeder hose yeah okay the whole thing but so we we found a E46 and we got some parts uh we got the gear knob and the the plastic thing uh and the trim pieces because uh, my trim pieces are shaking mm-hmm. and i have some fuses with me yeah <laughs> in case if we need them and we got the badge the rear badge and i don't think we need this but anyway we got it just in case uh 
and that's all and we are going to another record to find find the part that we are looking for the upper radiator hose because we didn't find it here like look like every bmw in the yard but we didn't find anything so so now we are going to another record and we'll see you guys there all right <laughs> yeah. It's a Nissan three three hundred CX. It's a Nissan three hundred ZX. Engine is still there. Yo guys, so we found the part finally. We got it from this 320i. And as you guys can see, it's the exact same part. This is the part from my car. And this one I took from this one. And it's, ex it's exactly the same. So, job well done. Now we have to go. We have to go and fix this. <laughs> We didn't find a find a grill in the backyard, so we are so the worst case scenario. So we are going to super glue the <laughs> grill to the bonnet, and before that we are gonna we bought a plastic can. We're gonna paint this in black, in matte black, and then we are going to super glue the. <laughs> Broken grill into the uh, bonnet. Here <laughs> So guys, uh, the second coat is done. Now we're gonna keep it a while, keep it for a while and let it dry and spray the third coat. <laughs> Race Karba? <laughs> So guys, this is the final product. As you guys can see, what is this, bro? What is this thing? It's a DIY can. <laughs> <laughs> it's a DIY can, bro. Sauce. Bro, it's a coffee, uh, coffee. Well, coffee cup. Yeah, yeah coffee yeah. cup, right? <laughs> <laughs> and we like oh, plastic dip it. Bro, that sexy egg sauce, bro. Hey, bro, what a race car, one, bro. Yo man, what's up? What's up? I a sexy exhaust, no? Yeah, bro. Uh, get this. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>